All right, welcome back to another edition of Energy Can Man Reviews. Uh, I got the uh, another little dollar uh, budget kind for you. This is an intent. I got lucky. This is actually a redo on this one. I did one Saturday or something, but the video got messed up, so I had to redo it. Redo, so I had to go back to the store and get another one. But um, definitely really cold, man. I lived in my car all morning. It's been real cold where I'm at, so really interesting. Now, this is the one I was talking about. If you've seen the other videos of the intents, well, they all have my sugar. Well, this is the uh, pretty much low sugar, I would say, version of it. And uh, I mean, it's kind of really easy because it is really cold. But uh, now this is the one, like, if I go to, like, and find, like, a budget energy drink, and now this is the Berry Punch, low-calorie Berry Punch. And uh, before I get started, please like, subscribe, comment, share the videos. But like I said, if I go to the store and before, when I see, like, something like these where you got these off-brand energy drinks, that's the first thing I do. I pick them up. I look on the back and I see which one got or used to before. I would see which one had you know the less you know sugar, and that's the ones I would get like the sugar free ones or low calorie ones, etc. That kind of deal. But now I might look at sure. I might now I kind of just try one of all of them and see which ones I like the most and then figure out how a combination I want to drink them. But I thought I knocked this out on lunch, like I said, Friday. Like I said, just got a couple of bit of hours here and then I go run home and enjoy my weekend and it's probably gonna be i'm gonna try to make this last drink i energy drink for my weekend so like i said i try to get myself saturday sun into detox so we'll see how that goes but um i never get these to try here uh like i said locale one so i don't have another candy intense with me all at the house but like i said you remember they all had like 45 like some ridiculous amount of sugar in them and so i did one i was like I said, it's got 160 milligrams of caffeine in it it's got a total fat zero um sodium 340 milligram total carbohydrate six gram uh total sugar three so like i said they definitely dropped the sugar level in this one now where it kind of blows your way is um i didn't realize like potassium it's got zero in it but uh your niacin it's got 40 milligram b6 is four milligram but all the buzz them at uh niacin is at 250 percent and then you got the uh, vitamin b6 at 240 percent B12 is at 500% at 12 MTG. And the, uh, I think this is the B5 or B3, but at 20 milligrams at 400%. And then, uh, oh, I just kind of noticed it, but it's distributed by Old East Main and Gottlesville, Goddard, Tennessee. So this is from Tennessee here, coming out of Tennessee. And uh, I used to drink a lot of these one here, like, but uh, this is the thing I'll try to show. When I was buying the uh, cheaper, you know, the budget alternative energy drink, that when I would buy them, I would always think, and I would look for ones like this, like low calorie, sugar free. And the reason I do that is because um, is it, instead of putting a cheap fill of sugar in there, they'll actually put more of the B vitamins and stuff in there, and that actually would give you a better intense uh, energy rush than the sugar one, because you would just get essentially a sugar rush. So that's why I did that with these. And that's kind of what got me where I used to drink a lot of sugar-free stuff. Before now, I kind of go like a sugary drink first and then a uh, sugar-free one. Now, let's see what we got here. Kind of like a real light, real light, like that uh, sugar-free uh, Red Bull I had earlier today. I don't know, it got like... The berry smell, it smells like if you ever had Jiffy's a blueberry mix, and you know, it don't even come real blueberry, it come like that little dye stuff, they just mush and it makes it look like a blueberry, but it ain't. That what it smells like. Have you ever smelled that? That's those things, it smells like an artificial blueberry. And that's essentially what you get with these. Cause I ain't gonna lie, sometimes it's tough to do some of these uh, budget ones cause it's just so artificial flavor tasting that it, when you kind of know you had a better ingredient, it tastes real flavor. Like I like them uh, sunshine one called. They actually taste real. They put real juice and fruits and vegetables in them to give it a good, real good flavor. It actually tastes like the fruits and vegetables it's trying to taste like. Yeah, let me get a little. It's like a real light brown. Oh, there we go. So that would kind of look you get there. Uh, let's try this thing out. I try like this. Like, it's better it's weird it tastes better than it smells like smelling it 
It does. It smells like a, uh, you know, some real cheap ass blueberry mix with that cheap fake blueberry stuff in it. And um, that would smell like, but that thing's not bad. That's the funny thing about it. It's got a pretty good taste to it. Kind of light, but. It's not bad. It's like, as long as you don't smell before you take the bread, like smell out here and then take your sip, it's not bad. But you, like I put my nose in there and, just, and I took a breath in before I was passing away. I smelled all that artificial blueberry kind of berry stuff and yeah, it didn't really go good with that one. But if I just try not to. I did not terrible, not the worst thing in the world. But uh, yeah, that's what I got on the intense one. But like I said, these are the budget ones. Like I said, berry punch, low calories, and they're not, like I said, not bad. Out of the dollar one, I was out of the intense one. I say this is the best one. That's why I was trying to really particularly look for this one. And I wanted to do you on it for y'all guys. Cause like I said, this is stuff I would drink. Well, back in the day when I this is stuff I would look for. I would go through little stores. And find, like I said, these little, you know, off the wall brands and look and see which one had like the least amount of sugars in them and stuff like that and had the most B vitamins in. That was the one I would buy. So, like I said, there's another review on the Intense Energy Drink and probably the last one. I think this is the last one I know of they have. So, but other than that, enjoy y'all Friday. Like I said, get to the weekend. Almost there. We're almost there. So, other than that, y'all have a good weekend.